Hello, I'm Steve Thorson with Union Marine, and today we're going to look at our 2018 Sea Ray L590 Fly. This is a brand new boat that is a demo, and we're going to look at a few features. On the bow area here, we have a nice seating area with sun pad for three and a table that will set up up on top. Moving aft, we have a full hard top that covers the bridge with a full enclosure. The bridge deck will feature heat and air conditioning, so a full climate control boat for year-round use. Moving aft, This boat has a hydraulic swim platform. The platform has a rating of 1,000 pounds, so a great place to put your dinghy. And it takes 10 seconds to go from full up to a full down position. So loading a dinghy is truly a one person job. Let's go on board. This is the aft cockpit area. This has a full canvas for enclosure for winter cruising. And we have a couple of nice features here. First off, we have an aft remote control docking for the Zeus pods with a separate bow thruster control. You have a great L-shaped seating back here, which is great for entertaining family and friends aboard. And we have a three panel sliding glass door that opens up to make the salon area part of the aft cockpit area. So it's an enormous social zone. Moving into the salon, galley, and dinette area, it really relays an open concept to this boat. Much like homes of today, this is a great area for keeping the family and friends together. On the starboard side over here, we've got a nice salon settee with a height of bed that pulls out that gives sleeping for two. Salon entertainment center back here with Bose surround sound system. This, the entertainment system here TVs, stereos, etc., are all controlled by an iPad. So you can control music throughout the entire boat, bridge, foredeck, cockpit, and salon, all separate, and you can control them simultaneously. The lower helm area here features dual screen Raymarine GS electronics with radar, GPS, chart plotter, the Mercury vessel view system, your Zeus control, and your bow thruster. Now we're gonna move forward down into the staterooms. Coming down the, the nice set of stairs, off to port, we have a full beam master stateroom with the queen size bed, a very large and ample head area, separate shower with a rain shower, Here's a great seating area here for hanging out in the master stateroom before retiring to bed. It's a nice queen bed with ample storage in drawers below. You've got four storage cabinets here, two hanging, as well as two with shelves and drawers besides drawers below. 
you've got a nice vanity here for that's lighted for doing makeup applying jewelry nice big windows both port and starboard so it gives a lot of natural light as well as cross ventilation when retiring to bed we'll head up and we'll take a look at the master sink area off to the starboard side right here we have a nice guest stateroom it has a separate washer dryer and a twin beds that go together to make a queen let's go in and take a look to open up full-size washer dryer a very nice cedar lined closet drawer storage shelving unit on the side the stateroom has the twin beds that make into a queen TV system here and ample storage above and below. Here is your second head. It's got a separate vanity, nice shower, and plenty of storage. Now we're coming forward to the VIP stateroom. You have double drawers below the bed, ample gunnel storage, both port and starboard, and great hanging locker, both port and starboard as well. So plenty of storage for clothes, shoes. It's a very elegant look to this boat. Now we're gonna transition up to the flybridge. Molded into the stairs, going up to the flybridge is a cockpit refrigerator, as well as a hidden electric grill. This is a great feature for barbecuing down below. And now we're going to transition up a nice set of stairs, not a vertical ladder to the bridge. This bridge also has a door that closes off to separate it. So if you were going to be entertaining up top and have guests below, it's a great way to create separation. Up here you have an enormous bridge with a nice entertainment center that features a refrigerator, a sink, another built-in grill for barbecuing. You've got two separate tables for entertaining and eating or having cocktails aboard. Both of these tables are electric, they go down cushions go on so it provides another area to sleep. This boat will sleep eight in beds in the main level between the master stateroom and the salon and up top here you could sleep another six people if one wanted to. Upper helm has dual GS Raymarine electronics, bow thruster, Zeus control, In front of the helm is a nice seating area with room to lay down and enjoy the sun or to cruise and have a great view.
This boat has separate heat and air units in each of the staterooms, in the salon, as well as up on the flybridge here. This truly makes this a year-round vessel for all seasons and all climates. Come see this boat today at Union Marine on Lake Union in downtown Seattle. And again, I'm Steve Thorson, and thank you for spending some time with me today.